When I was 15, I got my first real job working as a house painter. I got to work one morning, it was a beautiful day. I had decided to skip breakfast that morning and I told the other painter that I was working with that I wanted to do the high work up on the ladder. So that meant I was two stories up on that ladder. I had been working for maybe five minutes when suddenly I felt faint. And next thing I knew, I woke up on the ground to the sounds of screaming from the other painter who had found me. And then a CAT scan was done that showed me I had broken my neck in four places. The biggest thing that I think about the new legislation is that a 12-year-old does not have the capacity to make potentially life-threatening choices for themselves. It's kind of our responsibility as British Columbians to remove some of that choice from those young people and help guide them in terms of at least allowing them to mature to an age where they can make those decisions safely for themselves. When I first saw rugby, I was a little bit intimidated, I guess, in the beginning. It's full contact, so there's a lot of smashing of chairs, but also really excited about the prospect of having a sport that I could sort of dive into again and find that place to be competitive. And it definitely is a huge piece that I attribute into why I am at where I'm at in terms of independence and in terms of happiness in my general life. I think that there's a maturity that comes with age. So knowing now that BC legislation is changing to raise the working age from 12 to 16, is definitely reassuring to me just to know that people are hopefully gonna have just that little bit more of maturity and the ability to make those potentially life-threatening decisions for themselves, I think is gonna be a really great change.